Okay, this video is going to be a super duper quick one. For some reason, probably an American reason, the Windows key is on the right hand side. And where we would normally have the Windows key in the UK, we have the FN key. Having a look on the internet and whatnot, apparently these buttons just flip off. Uh, you put a little screwdriver or a trim removal tool under there and pop it off. Apparently, let's see if that really happens. Um, but yeah, you need to get it the BIOS first. So turn. Oh, there's it. Arrange this a bit better. Position it a bit better. So power on and immediately start pressing delete. Until you get it in the BIOS. There we go. Now apparently we come along the top menu just here. And we come to advanced and then go down to win Windows and FN key swap. It's currently disabled, so we'll enable it by pressing enter, scroll on down, press enter again, scroll back up. I don't know what any of these are just yet. I'll have to look them up. Go back to the top menu. Oh no, you don't go to the top menu. You just scroll right, right, all the way to save and exit. And you want to come down and save changes and reset. Save configuration and reset, yes. Laptop will restart. And I'll just try and get the screen in with the buttons. So the Windows key is still there. I just want to show you it working in this setup and then I'll just swap the keys over. It does have a pretty quick boot time on this. I am uh, I am impressed with it. Let's see I can't type passwords in properly. the Scoobaroo if you want to subscribe to the channel I've got that up to 472 breaks so far there's a load of videos I've also got a sorry I also had a white Hawkeye a newer version in Pretzer that I've got up to 400 and something break anyway so that's the Windows key you can just see my finger at the bottom here it's now the FN key so it shouldn't do anything which it's not and this is the FN key which should now be the Windows key and there we go. So I'll stop the video now and then I'll start it once I've, I'm ready to pop the, the keys off. Okay, so all the videos I've seen is you get a flat tip screwdriver, slide it under the button and then just pop. This feels so unnatural, it's horrible. That is just, I want to stop but apparently, yeah, there it goes. So that's either broken it or it's done. I sincerely hope that it's done. Now let's turn this round, get the other side, get the FN off. And it's the most unnatural feeling ever. Every part of my body wants me to stop doing that. Now, which way round does that go? Must be that way. Is it? Well, it's going on that way. So you rest it on, and apparently you just push. There we go. Well, that's a relief. Same with the FN. Place it on and push. All good. So as you can see there, it's all working good. What a relief.